guys you are welcome to my youtube channel and in case you are just joining this community don't forget to click on subscribe because here we give psychological solutions to psychological issues in the society so we'll be talking about motivation for a while and in case you've not been watching and following our series i would like you to go back to our previous video where you get more details on divinations and motivation in details so today i'm going to be talking about the two major types of motivation we have as you know that motivation has a lot to do with our emotions it determines how we feel at a particular time and what drives us to do a particular thing at a particular time so we have two major which is um, the intrinsic and the extrinsic kind of motivation now when we are talking about the intrinsic kind of motivation we are talking about a motivation that has to do with inner feeling a drive that has to do with your inner feel how you feel inwardly or what makes you feel a certain way inwardly now when we are talking about those things what are examples that we could see in the society we are talking about your interest we are talking about your hobbies we are talking about those things that you know that when you get yourself involved in it they drive you to be happy they drive you to do certain things they drive you to like they stimulate you they trigger you to do some things for example an incident that occurred as at yesterday which is still trending till today which is i'm going to be using as a case study david o issue now something must have triggered david o internally to feel like okay i want to check the level of my influence on people around the world and he just felt like i'm sure it is not actually the money that triggered david o. it's not the money that really matters to me but he was triggered that he needs a level of self-satisfaction to check how much impact he has actually made on people around. And the best way he could survey that was using a money to clear a particular car as a survey, which actually shows how much of influence the guy has really gained in this generation. Now, that will bring me to a place of citing it as an what intrinsic motivation because the, the fact that people are responding to him is giving him such an inner feeling of being fulfilled. It's Give him such an inner feeling of of the fact that he has added value to people and is helping people to be to give them vibes to make them happy and there's no other joy i mean for somebody like him that does what he does which is things and this thing there is no greater joy than that kind of joy you'll be feeling right now not joy the joy of the money in his account but the joy that is giving joy to others that can serve as a what intrinsic motivation whereby when you do certain things you just feel that okay this thing that i do is adding value and is giving me joy is giving me happiness you know you just feel that that thing is driving you to do more that thing is helping you to become more better now every individual has to get to a level whereby they have to discover that intrinsic motivation what is that thing internally that gives you joy what is that thing internally that drives you what is that thing internally that stimulates you to do certain things intentionally not just something that you just do shabbily not just something that you just do anyhow things that you do intentionally and you feel gratitude towards for doing them intentionally so i'll talk about extrinsic motivation we are talking about things around you for example people that have jobs their day-to-day -day activities and they are getting paid for it it's more like an extrinsic motivation probably you work and you get your salary or probably maybe you sell one or two things and you get your salary and so for us that you are not getting paid you know the fact that you are getting good accolades from people that we are doing a good job is also a form of okay for me it's actually an intrinsic motivation not an extrinsic motivation anyway maybe someday we'll start getting extrinsic motivation you know what i'm saying but what i'm saying in the essence is that for human to keep going, for you to get to that place that you need in life, for you to become that person, for you to really achieve so many things in life, you need two, these two major kinds of motivations that I just mentioned. You need an internal feeling that drives you, and you also need an external force that propels you to keep doing the things that you do and keep getting certain results. Now, if you have been frustrated that you are doing a particular thing and you are not getting results, that is because you have been doing it the same way, or probably what has been driving you is not genuine enough to produce results so what you just need to do is probably change your motive behind what you are doing so that it will stimulate you to produce a different kind of result or probably change your style or your ideology towards that thing so that you can actually produce results on it or probably maybe it's just a routine kind of person i just feel stressed and just like you are tired of this kind of life you've been living a particular job all for the same thing 
maybe it's high time you do the same thing in a different way probably just take yourself out maybe hang out with friends that you know they are of like minds or people that can encourage you or probably just catch up with something or read a book or go on a vacation or so many things now when you engage in those kind of things that are pertaining to nature when you engage in your hobbies when you engage in things that helps your mind to be a little bit lighten up there's a way to renew your motives it renews your energy and it renews your drive to become something better so that is all i am going to be dwelling on on this week's series in my next week's series i tell you how to create your motivation both intrinsic and intrinsic and in case you are wondering that what is it i think this is high time you sit down and ask yourself what could be your motivation drive for me my drive is the fact that psychology is giving people solutions in the society so i'll see you guys again next time don't forget to give us thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to this youtube channel and don't forget to invite a friend to this community this is a tribe we are getting bigger and also don't forget to ask yourself again what is my intrinsic and extrinsic motivation i'll see you guys again next week bye bye